Okay, hey Taurus, so this is going to be a general reading. Okay, Spirit, what messages do you have here for Taurus? What messages do you have here for Taurus? Um, Taurus, I'm getting like, you're about to find out some type of information here. That's what I'm getting. You're about to find out some type of information. And I'm getting, it's going to help you move forward here. That's what I'm getting. It's going to help you move forward. Um, yes, yeah, somebody is in regret in regards to an empress here as well. Okay, somebody regrets like juggling an empress is what this is. Or like maybe treating you like an option or something like that here. That's what I'm getting or not really investing in you. That's what this is. That's what I'm getting here towards. It's like somebody is realizing that they were dealing with an empress. But this individual kind of like didn't really invest in you. That's what I'm getting here. Um... Somebody's about to, I'm really getting, wow. Somebody is really upset and bothered in regards to how they treated you is what this is. This could be a masculine energy that's upset in regards to how he treated you. I don't know why. And I got this energy for you in a previous reading. Um, somebody could be up in their head because somebody has learned that you're about to level up or something here. Yeah, or this person is just up in their head because, like, you're a very loving person, but you're frustrated and irritated with a situation or somebody. Could be a masculine energy. It's like now you're queen of swords towards this person, but in the past, you could have been very loving and compassionate to this person. But now, like, you're putting your foot down or something like that here. This man regrets like juggling you and like playing games with you or trying to like play you or something. You know what I'm also getting? This could be somebody that was like trying to act like they weren't really interested in you when this person was. That's what I'm getting. So this is a masculine energy that was like trying to act like he was not really interested in you when he actually was. And he feels like he missed out on a connection or the opportunity to connect with you. Or something like that. Because he didn't really invest in you. That's what I'm getting. Like he feels like. I don't know. Oh we. Whoever this person is. This person wants to be a power couple with you. Or something. That's what I'm getting Taurus. Somebody wants to be a power couple with you. But this person didn't invest in you in the past. What's going on here. Yeah, um, you're over it. You're like, no, I'm good. <laughs> you're like, no, I'm good. I'd rather be by myself and single. Um, this person plays too many games is what this is. It's like somebody was trying to act like they weren't really interested in you when this person was. This person really wants to be a power couple with you or something like that. Could be because you're about to level up here. But this person didn't invest in you in the past. Yep. Um, somebody wants to make some type of move towards you. But this person is nervous or something like that here. Oh, wow. Because this person knows that like you're going to tell them off or something like that here. Because like you already know somebody is only coming back around to you to connect with you because you leveled up. See, in the past... You were of no value to this person is what this is. Yeah. Yep. And you don't want nothing to do with this individual. When you were kind of like, I don't know, maybe this person thought you were broke or something, you know, or something weird like that. Like somebody thought you were broke or somebody just thought that you weren't going to do anything with your life. Now somebody wants to be a power couple with you. Yep. 
this person could also want you like somebody wants you to have their baby here as well what maybe this person thinks that that's gonna keep you around or something so you may want to be mindful yep uh somebody whoever this person is you feel like this person is extremely immature so you are not going to deal with this individual here this person plays too many games and you don't have time for it you feel like this person is like very immature and it's like a waste of your time that's what i'm getting so you don't want to deal with this person what's going on here yep <laughs> you don't want to deal with this person that's what i'm getting you feel like this person is also like whoever this masculine energy is this person is sneaky he's only coming back around to you because he knows that you're about to level up and he now wants to be a power couple with you is what this is yeah yep what's going on here yeah, this person is, this is too many, but this individual is up in their head. Somebody feels extremely foolish. It's like, somebody's like, damn, why didn't I stay with Taurus? Why didn't I stay with Taurus? Now Taurus is coming into this abundance and Taurus is going to go build with somebody else. That's what this person, like somebody knows that you're going to go build with somebody else. This person abandoned you when this individual felt like you were a burden to them that's exactly what this is it's like this individual feel like you were a burden to them so this individual uh abandoned you or some like that ghosted you didn't really invest in you or was like doing a bare minimum like this individual was really interested in you but trying to act like this person was not interested in you maybe this person thought that like you would chase them or something and like you just moved on with your life you're like nope i don't have time you too childish you too immature for me yep this person is somebody abandoned you when yeah like you're over this you're over it and whoever you are it's like you had a lot of love for this person in the past but now you're queen of swords it's like somebody is shocked in regards to your cutoff game you're like nope you're not invested in whoever this person is this masculine energy yep damn didn't i tell you like this person didn't this person abandoned you or ghosted you when this person thought you were broke or maybe somebody i don't know somebody saw something slowing down for you so this person was like oh taurus is broke and then like you're about to level up and this person's gonna try to come back around to you but this person you know left you out in the cold when you were doing bad this person is like i don't know this person regrets doing that to you, though. Cancer could be significant to you here. Capricorn, Scorpio, Leo, Gemini. What's going on here with Taurus? Yep. <laughs> I'm telling you, like, if something slowed down for you and somebody, like, ghosted you or decided they didn't want to deal with you because this individual felt like, I don't know, this person felt like you were not an empress or you were not a divine feminine or something like that here. Somebody wanted this person to look at you like that here as well. So somebody could have been involved in something happening to, like, slow you down. Yep. Somebody tried to slow your money down so like somebody wouldn't look at you like, a, oh, wow. You know what I'm getting? This could be like, there's there could be a karmic that like tried to slow your money down so a masculine energy wouldn't look at you like an empress because this karmic wanted to be with this masculine energy and this masculine energy could have like did the bare minimum in regards to you or, you know, just somebody felt like you weren't an empress. So you moved on with your life. I'm telling you, this, like, that was a blessing. That was a blessing. Even though something underhanded happened to you, it was a blessing. Because somebody would have been with you only for your abundance. Is what this is. And because something slowed down for you, there's a masculine energy that didn't invest in you. Because he thought you weren't an empress. And you're about to be wealthy. 
<laughs> you're about to be wealthy. Um, and somebody is shocked because your source of wealth is coming from something totally different than what this person thought your wealth was going to come from is what this is. Yep. I'm telling you, like somebody didn't think that you were, I don't know. Somebody thought you were broke or something like that here. Somebody thought you were broke. Maybe you could have been struggling financially here. Yep. Somebody, you could have been struggling financially. Yep. But you were not somebody's happiness because you were, you know, struggling financially. So this person ghosted you, left you out in the cold, whatever this individual did, and you're about to level up. <laughs> That's what I'm getting. This could even be somebody that like broke up with you when like you were struggling financially because this person felt like you were a burden only for you to become extremely wealthy extremely wealthy if you are an artist something like maybe you're a musician maybe you are like an artist here i'm getting contemporary art abstract art could be significant to you as well you're about to be very wealthy and this person's like punching the air like damn why didn't i stay with Taurus? Because it was divinely meant to happen the way it happened. Because had you been connected with this person, when this abundance comes in for you, this person would have only been with you for your abundance. That's what I'm getting. Yeah, this King of Swords, I told you it was a masculine energy. Whoever this King of Swords energy is, any sign. But whoever this King of Swords is, like he broke up with you. Because he felt like you weren't going to do anything with your life. Or you weren't going to be anything. That was a blessing. Yep. We have double mission here. Light worker, star seed. Serve the world by being you. And we have you're not alone. Isolation. Physical connection. Community. I was about to say you're not for everyone. So. Wow. Okay. Yeah. Whoever you are. You're a good person. You are very mindful in regards to your energy. You're not just out here trying to connect with anybody, just any old person. Like you're very mindful in regards to your energy. You have a calling over your life is what I'm getting. Yep. Um. Somebody also, somebody tried to have you isolated or could have tried to get you fired. Somebody's karma could have been involved in getting you fired. So this king of swords wouldn't look at you like an empress. And that was a blessing. That's what I'm getting. Yeah, fall into my arms. Yep. Damn, karmic relationship. Didn't I tell you? So you avoided a karmic relationship here, Taurus. Somebody rejecting you or the fact that somebody abandoned you when this individual thought you were broke was actually divine protection. It was divine protection. Because this, like, you would have went into a karmic relationship with somebody that would have only wanted to be with you because, like, you have this abundance coming in for you. I'm also getting like, you're about to be a very successful artist. I've been getting that in these readings. Like, Samo, like, that was Basquiat's street name. So, like, maybe you do something in regards to art under a different name or something like that. Somebody thought you were broke or you were just going to be, like, a broke boy or a broke gal. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe you could be from the Caribbean or something like that. Or somebody is from the Caribbean. But somebody thought that you were going to be a broke boy or a broke gal or something like that. And you're about to level up here. Yeah, child of the cosmos. The intelligence of the universe lies within you. Um, Yeah. You are the artist here, Taurus. That's what I'm getting. You can create whatever you want for yourself. Um, Something that you've been working on is about to pay off for you. This is, like I said, be in regards to your artwork. Um, but somebody didn't know that you had this coming in for you. Um, uh, somebody may try to come back around to you here as well with this fall into my arms and karmic relationship. So be mindful. You may have a karmic from your past trying to come back around to you and now invest in you or something like that. But this person, like I said, didn't invest in you when this person thought you were like a broke boy or a broke gal or something like that. And now like your artwork is about to be in... I'm getting something in regards to a very popular art studio. 
a very popular art studio here, but I'm going to end it there, Taurus.